All right. Uh, round three at the Card Academy, thecardacademy.net. Use code PIMP on single card orders of $100 or more to get 10% off. Use code MEGAPIMP on single card orders of $200 to get 20%. 20% off. Yes. There we go. I should have just made you do it. Five, three. You got it. Hey, hey, no. 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 Not happening. No. <laughs> Not happening. Uh, one, two. Should I just do three for safe measure? Yeah, three. Dropping three. Dropping three. Okay. That works. My turn. Here we go. All right. Draw for turn. Uh, clock. Draw two. Beginning of climax phase. It's the only character on my stage. Send a waiting room. Uh, discard a card. Set, change into a level one or lower Luvia. Mm -hmm. Direct for three. Draw for turn. Control two. Move over. Five hundred assists with the startup to pay one, ditch a climax and salvage. Um, same thing. When this direct attacks, I can choose a level zero or lower in your front row, and that character can't stand. Mm -hmm. Can't really do that. Go to attacks. Direct, that card can't stand. For three. Six five front. For one in a salvage. On reverse, choose a gem character in my waiting room, put it under as a marker. She gets 1k per marker. Go ahead. One, two, three. Um, beginning of attacks, mill. So it'll be for oh, two. two. Six. Actually, should have left it. Oh, well. It's fine. Stand. Draw. Clock and level. Experience three is now active. Draw two. If I have experience three or higher, she gets, or she's a 500 assist, and pay one rest her brainstorm for each climax salvage. Go ahead, brainstorm. All right. One K one. Direct for three. Direct for four. Uh, 
direct for four. Go ahead. Interesting. Hit two. Pay one, drop one, search. Feed the beast. Don't kill it. <laughs> yeah. It's like nobody want me to build markers or anything. I feel like that's how this day's been. Speaking of attacks, shiz. I know the feel. One, two, two. Let me guess, level reverse? Yep. On reverse, get a marker. <laughs> Not like it matters, but still. Uh, seven, five, because I keep forgetting to use this ability. Not that it matters. Declare front, reveal, add to hand. One, two, three. Cancels. Reveal top. One, two, two. Sticks. It's fine. Stand and draw. All right, this Clock. playlist went all the draw way two. <laughs> Activate Brainstorm. Pay one rest Brainstorm. Hit one, search, or salvage one. I'll wait for you to finish. 
I did hit one on my brainstorm and grab those. Okay. Um, when she goes to waiting room, I can pay one, ditch one, salvage. I start this feeding bullsh all over again. Um... If I have experience two or higher, she gains 1k, but all my other characters cannot side attack. Which I'm okay with, actually. Uh, Red Stock Soul. Declare front when this card attacks, discard a card, mill, send him to waiting room. It targets cost one, uh, that's the combo with the stock soul. When it attacks, discard a card, mill the top card of my deck. If it's a gem, choose a cost one or lower on my opponent's field. Send it to waiting room, she gets 1500 power until the end of turn. Mm -hmm. So this is going to be six, seven, five, eight for one, two, or for one, two, two. Is that the marker one? Yes. How does... 6-5 from here. No, no, no. I'm just... Oh, wait, no. You, never mind. Climax combo makes her 8k. Okay. For how many? For two. On a verse, marker. Direct. Two. Three? Three, my bad. Direct three triggers my refresh. How many going in? Seven. Go to tap. All right. Refresh point. Go ahead. Search one. Does it matter? Nope. Why'd you do that then? Because it doesn't matter. Oh my god. <laughs> What's the power? 
75. 3K, 75, and 75. So. Hi, Will Ream. One, two. Level. Uh, well, you get it. <laughs> you tried so hard for that. <laughs> tried so hard for that. I'm sorry, Mike. It's all good. Two. What? Why? Because it keeps pooping on you? Shh. My Xenon deck doesn't poop on me. It's just the meta deck that does. One, two, two. Sticks. What do I have in here? Um, not activating her waiting room ability. Yeah. Draw for turn. Clock draw two. Brainstorm. Hit two, salvage two. Salvage one, and salvage two. Brainstorm. Salvage two. Someone's going to be overhand size. Oh wait, I can salvage too. Duh. I like this hand. I like this hand a lot. Five. How big is he? Uh, 5k? 5'5? Five five? Yeah. 8'5 front. For two. Direct. Uh, one sec. Okay. Six, seven. Don't like any of my... Direct for four. No. Oh, yeah. Shoot. I missed uh I missed her reverse trigger. Uh direct for three. Three. Oh yeah. And you're right. I am overhand size. <laughs> Ready. Draw for turn.
Comes in play. Drop a climax. Salvage. What's this one do? Uh, it's a uh, 500 assist and has a startup to pay one digit climax salvage. Beginning of... Wait, what's this one's power? 7-5. But it, it forces the rest of my characters to be unable to side attack. Okay, 7 five, 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 six, five, seven. Ah, forget it. One. One. Cancel. One, one, stick, level. Stick any damage, so whatever. One, one. Sticks. Marker. Hit. Stand. Draw. Tap. Tap. There you go. I can actually do this. Wow. Never thought I'd be able to do it. Rin. Pay two. On play, draw two. Triggers refresh. Tap. Tap. Finish resolving effect. Ditch one. Refresh point. Play over my Ren for Luvia, pay two heal on play, and gets 500 for every other uh, gem character on the field. Brainstorm. Hit one, salvage one. Play over. Global 1k, when I play a climax, I can choose a character goat 1500. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I should just can't do it now. Um, 1k1, combo with the Rin when she attacks. Pay 2, ditch 1. She gets 3k and burn 4. Mm -hmm. Uh... Her ability activates, get 1500 here. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10, 5, 12, uh, 12 13k front for two. Uh, 
I know I did reverse that, so on reverse marker. Direct for four. Declare direct, pay two. Ditch one, burn four. This will be for four. Six. Go ahead. Oh boy. Search one. Is that really? Got to try and go for it, and I don't have enough stock. What's the power of the field? Uh, let's see, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, five, eleven. This is eleven, five, nine, five, ten, five, because of experience. Eleven, five, twelve k, and she is nine, ten, eleven. 12.5. At four climaxes in waiting room. I think four in waiting room. No. Mm. Three. I can't count. No counters. Uh, Alright, just gotta go all out here. <laughs> Like this one bit. So, uh, what were the powers again? Uh, 10, 11, 5, 12, K, 12, 5. Cut tap. Tap. Boop. Still don't like this. Cards in hand. Five. Uh, four in there. It's actually only three. three. I miscounted. Screw it. Go. YOLO. YOLO. Oh, YOLO. What's stock, boys? It's an on reverse burn one, right? Yep. Okay. How many do you have in hand? Oh, well. Too late. Begin climax phase. Pump that 500. Okay, one. Gotcha. 14-5 for three. Three. 
And then burn one on reverse? Yeah. All right. 14, 5 for 3. 4. On 15K? Mm -hmm. For 4, you said? Yep. Cancels on 4? 15K for 3. 4. So 15k? Mm-hmm. 155? Cancels. <sighs> Alright. And I believe your these two Akatsukis are dead. Oh yeah. My bad. Draw? I just gotta go for broke here. Climax is in waiting room. Six. I need four to stick. Can I do it? Can I do it? I must have confidence if I'm doing a stupid play like that. Um, direct two. Direct four. How big is she? She's a 10 5. 13K. 13K front. Two. Max's waiting room. Seven. Hmm. One, two, and a pass. Game. Oh, you had one in a hand. It just triggered a lot of good reasons. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> good uh, reason. That was rough. That was. I actually contemplated playing another one of those when I had enough stock to burn you twice. Would that have done it? I think I... Where were my climaxes after that? 
I should have played my clock on course here away and forced myself to level three first. Worked out in the end, but that was just on luck. Alright. Let's go ahead and stop this recording.